Hello, uh, my name is Cam Hartley. I'm a professional musician. Welcome to the South Central Regional Library Safe Inside Your Walls programming, supported by Safe at Home Manitoba. This is now part three of seven little parts uh, taking you from having a ukulele in your hand to being able to play a couple little songs with your ukulele. Part one, we just talked about playing ukulele. Part two, we talked about the little pieces of it, head, neck, body. And in this part, we're going to tune up the ukulele. We're gonna make your ukulele sound like mine. How we're gonna do that is I'm gonna pluck a string on mine, and I'm gonna pluck what's called the first string, like that, and you can pluck yours, and you wanna make yours sound like mine. So I pluck, and you take your tuning knob, turn your string up or down, tighten it or loosen it until you get this sound. Good. Then we move on to the second string. And you make your string sound like mine. Tighten your string or loosen it. Good, moving on to the third string. I'm using my thumbnail, but you can use plucking, you can use your thumbnail, you can use the ball of your thumb. Okay, going to the number four string. Tighten or loosen your string till you see that it's, the, till you hear that it's the same. Now tuning can be a pain in the uh, pain, but it is also a wonderful training for your ear. And as you get into playing the ukulele or any instrument, the ability of your ears to hear differences in sound will become more and more important. And everything will get easier as your ear gets better and better trained. That doesn't mean you have to do any work. It happens all by itself, which is pretty wonderful. Let's go over this sound of the ukulele one more time. Your first string, second string, third string, fourth string. So now we're going to do something with the ukulele. We're gonna take our third finger and we're gonna put it on the first string on the third fret. And you want to get the point of the finger right down on top of the string. So it's pressing straight down on the string like that. Now, when you start to play, you might find that your finger's over here, or it might be over here. Don't worry about it. If you start to get a sound like this, that's okay. That just means you're not pressing hard enough on the string, and that will come with time. So if you have your third finger on the first string, on the third fret, and you're running your thumb over the strings like this, you're strumming in some way, you can use your thumb, you can use your fingers, you can go down, you can go up, you can hit it with your hand if you want. You can do just about anything to make sound to come out of your ukulele. Anyway, my point is you're now playing the C chord. This is a C chord. You're actually playing the ukulele. Yahoo, come back for part four. <laughs>